with influencer marketing, are there any specific variables that you would look for to see if it's working or not, right? Like if somebody, let's say they want to do this, what would you recommend them to set up so they can track if it's working or not, right? Like we can see, I'm sure you can see some Instagram. I think now Instagram has some great analytics that if you're a, a business partner or a paid partner, you can see the stats from the post of the person. So that can give you a good understanding at least of reach and engagement that it's getting. But if you want to get down to tracking or at least correlating revenue with that activity, what are some of the steps that you would recommend people take? Is it just a code that they could put on their store? What What are some of those steps that they can take? Uh, traditionally, before I jump into this, I wanted to actually pick up on your uh, phrase and say, also, uh, as as an entrepreneur, I learned the the, the worst risk is trying nothing, like you know, mm-hmm. doing and not taking the risk. A lot of people look at the say advertising or influencer marketing as a risk or investment that you they're not sure if it's gonna uh, have any return. But I would say the the higher risk is that that you look back and seeing your competition are leveraging in that channel and taking get to the next level and getting the best out of it so don't think that way go in and experiment with it uh, in terms of tracking performance basically traditionally what a lot of people have done is that that they try to track clicks by you know through like a clickable links and making sure they can see at least from the social channel of certain influencers that they are working with how many li- clicks have been sent back to their website and then through the google analytic they could see how many of th- those guys purchased or downloaded their their apps there are many tools built for that like google analytics on the app side if you are downloading apps branch.io and also uh, associating all, all of these um, with a coupon code, as you mentioned, like, you know, mm-hmm. a lot of businesses say like, listen, I give it 10% coupon code to all of your audience and also 10% revenue to you off of each purchase, right? Mm-hmm. So you as an influencer go out and you promote a drink and saying, buy this on this website, coupon code XYZ, and then you can track everything. What we are doing at the influencer is that actually this is more of like an affiliate uh, uh, marketing as well. So we are trying to streamline the entire business into one place in a way that you could not only generate trackable links and short links that can sit in influencers' bio, but also you could we could you could put a pixel on our platform and go back. And we could learn from all the users that are going to your website and purchasing or downloading or doing uh, the CTA that you were trying to achieve and then give you all, the whole report. Right now uh, on AFluencer.com, what we do is that we track the reports on the post, as you mentioned as, as well, like with likes, comments. And the next phase, what you're doing is a clicks and then making sure there is a bridge between our platform and your website or uh, any other analytic call tools that you are using. Mm-hmm.